All right, this is too much of a Frankenstein effort for me to pass up recording this. But the shit I'm doing here to stick this big ass card to the 2070 NVIDIA RTX 2070. In other words, this card was in there. Hope you can see it. Just about half the size of that card. So, what I'm trying to do now is get a faceplate on here. Get a faceplate so it can have some stability. I think I got enough space for ventilation because there's about that much space under the bottom where the fans are at. But ultimately what I'm gonna have to do is get it on the case. I might have to leave this just off. Let's come up with another solution. Because I don't You ain't taking this back to the store. Of course, once you open the box, you can't take it back no damn way. Well, turns out that whole interaction trying to put that GE Force RTX 2070 into the X51 Alienware did not go as planned so guess what we have to build us a computer now I neither want need or require another computer but since I can't take this card back and it was $500, damn. I am forced to build a computer, which I guess is not a big deal. It ought to be fun. So we're going to build... Uh, we're going to use this Roswell. We're going to start with the case. Roswell ATX mid-tower case for gaming PC with the liquid cooling and a 750 watt power supply that's what we're starting with and we're going to start with this uh, GeForce RTX 2070 video card and I guess I'll buy motherboard case and motherboard case and the uh, I'm sorry motherboard CPU and memory all in one I just don't know what I want to go with I used to go with the AMD's but AMD's everyone I've had has ended up burning up and uh, my x51 is an Intel i7 I have had zero problems so I may stick with that even though AMD is cheaper but Every AMD I've had has burned up. So, yeah. So, I'll uh, definitely be recording this bill and posting it on the channel. Peace.